Thank you very much. For customs. The dwarf tree has arrived and it was obviously opened by customs for examination. So uh, let's see what's in the box. It has been resealed very carefully. So I'm going to use just the tip of the blade to avoid cutting anything in there. Very heavily taped. And it says uh, US Customs Service on it. And there we go. Box inside the box. Ta-da! Dwarf 3. The box is sealed. So there is no evidence that it was opened. So maybe they only examined the outside because that uh, plastic all around it seems to be the original considering that uh, there is the green arrow on it that suggests that this is indeed Dwarf Lab original. So maybe the only thing that customs examined was the big box. Let's hope so. But so far everything looks good. Dwarf 3. Inside it, there is... Yeah, this is still sealed. I feel good about this. So it is not going to be an IKEA telescope as we had feared. It comes in a nice bag. And uh, as you can tell, I have Dwarf 2 next to me for comparison. First of all, there's a small box. Ah, it is the solar filter. Sunglasses. Very nice. You may recall when we got the Dwarf 2 it did not come with solar filters, had to order them separately. So this is the solar filter. They are nice and flashy. They are ND100,000 as opposed to ND1 million that was uh, Dwarf 2. I will not be using them today. We have mosquitoes to deal with. Very nice, very nice touch. Charging cable, USB-C to USB-C. And uh, I don't know what this is. Ah, the shoulder strap the bag which definitely comes in handy in my case it's added uh, security to the bag and then there is a manual user's manual dwarf tree Okay, let's look at the dwarf next. 
it is heavier than the dwarf too that's for sure nothing else in the bag I'm not gonna toss it just gonna put it away here for a second and let's look at dwarf 3 the dogs have calmed down a bit they were anxious to help me open the dwarf 3 Let's hope they stay quiet for a moment while we finish this unboxing. Okay, the bag is sealed. Uh, making me feel even better that uh, the scope has not been opened. Nice silver color. Compared to Dwarf 2. Okay, we're going to do some uh, essential measurements here for comparison's sake. Dwarf 2 is 20 centimeters or 8 inches. Dwarf 3, 22 centimeters or 8 and 3 quarter inches. Height, Dwarf 2 is 5 and a half inches. Dwarf 3 is 6 inches. Thickness 2.5 by eh, 2 and a quarter. So here they are side by side. One more thing weight. No, that's weight as in how much they weigh, not weight as in uh, WAIT. Dwarf 2, 1,158 grams. Dwarf 3, 1,395. So, for those who want different units, Okay, come on. Dwarf 3 is 3 pounds. Very appropriate. Dwarf 2 is 2 pounds. Actually, 2 pounds and 9 ounces versus 3 pounds and 1 ounce. What else do we know about it? It is a bit harder to turn, so I'm not going to force it, and the base is a lot harder to turn, so I'm not going to force it. There is a speaker, and a microphone, speaker here, microphone there, so I will be able to record the voice of birds and all my ramblings if and when they occur. Let's see if it turns on. It is turning on. So this is a good sign. And uh, it moved just a tiny bit. So we are good. Turned off. Next step is to charge it fully. Read the instructions. And uh, wait for the new app from Dwarf Lab so we can start using it. But for now, the Dwarf 3 has landed. And we're going to be doing a lot of side-by-side -side comparison between Dwarf 2 and Dwarf 3. Tonight would have been an ideal night to do some imaging. Uh, if I get the app in time, then uh, we will start using uh, the telescope. One quick observation, Dwarf 3 did not come with a tripod, so I will be using uh, one of my big tripods. It seems to have the same quarter inch mount as the Dwarf 2, 
given that it's uh, a whole kilogram heavier, uh, I will not use the Dwarf 2 tripod. I have no shortage of tripods here, so we will be using big tripod. And for now, at least, I don't think it's going to be perched up on the third floor on my little uh, angle bracket. That will be reserved for Dwarf 2 for the, for the time being. Okay, so long again.